Hey there, it's Rob, the Ignorant Entrepreneur, and today I wanted to talk about something you guys know I had to talk about, right, Robert Bacon? Bacon Protocol offers industry-first NFT mortgages, no relation. But anyway, decentralized mortgage lender Bacon Protocol has minted its first seven mortgages as non-fungible tokens or NFTs, offering investors and borrowers new options for assessing the residential mortgage market. Now, the interest rates for each NFT mortgage ranges from about 1.5 to 3.1% on properties in four U.S. states. And this was actually disclosed Wednesday. That's the interest rate borrowers pay after minting their mortgage through Bacon Protocol. By comparison, the average mortgage rate in the U.S. ranged from 2.27% to 2.98% for the first week ending November 10th, according to Freddie Mac. The 30-year fixed rate mortgage peaked at 3.14% on October 28th. You can actually see a representation here on the screen. Now, with Bacon's decentralized mortgage platform, which launched in September, it gives homeowners the ability to exchange a lien or a right to keep possession of property belonging to another person until a debt owed by that person is discharged on their property for an NFT that represents a portion of its value. In fact, in May of this year, blockchain startup Proppy became the first company to launch a real estate NFT, offering a tangible use case for smart contracts in the residential housing market. Whereas Proppy auctioned a physical apartment as an NFT, Bacon Protocol is minting mortgages that finance residential properties. Bacon Protocol NFTs are based on smart loans that are developed by platform originator LoanSnap, which uses artificial intelligence to determine mortgage eligibility. And this is sort of how Bacon Protocol explains it. The NFTs work by wrapping the lien on a home while the protocol then lends against the NFT. Once a mortgage NFT is minted, it's sent to the homeowner who then makes payments directly to Bacon Protocol. Keep in mind, more than a decade removed from the 2008 financial crisis, which was punctuated by the subprime mortgage meltdown, the residential mortgage market appears ripe for disruption. In addition to giving homeowners the ability to exchange a lien on their property for an NFT at lower interest rates, Bacon Protocol intends to make investments in the market easier through its Be Home token, which is backed by USD coin, liens, and loans on US properties. Bacon Protocol co-founder Carl Jacobs said the mortgage industry is not meant to be replaced, but built upon with new technology. He actually was quoted as saying that. He also said that NFTs and smart contracts fit perfectly into the lending world as they are similar to many legal arrangements in real estate with upgraded technology and features. Woo, glad to see Bacon winning. <laughs> Let me know what you guys think in the comments section below. As always, don't forget to like and subscribe. This has been The Ignorant Entrepreneur. I'm out.